Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You lose your owner, buddy? <laughs> okay, then. Let's stick together. Up here, on the balcony. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please!
Nice. Glad to help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. God damn it. Who are these people? Just folks looking for a new home, a fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. It's just me, the Longs, Marcy and June. That's all Mama Murphy on the couch. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. It's a cruel world. God you think it. I don't know that? The things I've seen. The things I've done. Anyway, huh. we figured Concord would be a safe place uh, to settle. That ain't it. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Will it be enough to stop those maniacs? Sturgis, tell her. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. What makes that power armor so special? A West Tech internalized servo system, that's what! Inside that baby, super is the new normal. You'll be stronger, tougher, resistant to rads, and... Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that. And those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Minigun. <laughs> now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. 
I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Excellent. Careful, kid. Bingo. Just say trapped in here. Angry. Ma'am. Now look who Somebody dog do something. meat brought to us. So he's your dog? Aw, uh, he ain't my dog. No, sir. Dog meat, he's what you call his own man. You can't own a free spirit like that. But he chooses his friends and sticks with them. He'll stay by you now. I saw it. Please, tell me what you know. Just listen to me. Acting <laughs> a crazy old lady. It's the chems, you see. They give old Mama Murphy the sight. Been that way since I was a girl. That's incredible. I can see a bit of what was, and what will be, and even what is right now. And right now, I can see this something coming, drawn by the noise and the chaos. And... It is angry. What is it? Mama Murphy, I need more. Please. I see. I, I see. Oh. It's, it's horrible, kid. Claws and... Teeth and horns, the very face of death itself. That's all I can manage. That's all. I need to rest now, and you have a job to do. Hi. Like it or not, we're all counting on you. Sturgis. That armor may be old, but it's got a standard interface. Just jack the fusion core in. Mister? Yeah, I, I promised we'd get there. I promised. I, I promised we'd get there. I promised. I, I couldn't keep my promise. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You can't I'm just so stay sorry. trapped in here. So, this is ridiculous. So, somebody do something. Hey. The Minutemen were supposed to protect us. Garby promised. He promised!
Up here. Boss! Opening we got fire. somebody up here! Why don't you get down here? Show here. me that fancy gun up close. Not a lot of people can get past mind. my boys. Give you that! Come on, I got places to be! Take it easy, Mama. You okay? I'm fine, Preston. Quit fussing. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. You guys gonna be okay now? Yeah. For a while, anyway. We can at least move someplace. Listen. When we first met, you said you were glad to help. 
Well, you did. And we owe you our lives. So here. It ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. I didn't do it for the money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone being in it only for themselves. You know, you remind me of my friends. The other Minutemen. The ones who gave their lives for something bigger than themselves. You should come with us to Sanctuary. We could use the help. What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Cause there's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Please, tell me. I need to know. You are a woman out of time. Out of hope. But all is not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. I knew it. Please, tell me where he is. I need to find my son. I can't see him. Not clearly. But I feel his life force. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. Please, Mama Murphy. I'm working from nothing. I need more. Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Well, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, well, she's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, out hold any on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy... Got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh. Okay. Right behind you, boss.
Hey there. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here. Over 200 years ago. I, I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Just my son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there, somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? What kind of help do they need? Sounded like the usual. Raiders. You'll have to get all the details when you talk to them. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Hi. Hi. Uh, hey, do you have a moment? I just want to trade a few things. I'm sorry. I, I, I wouldn't be very good company right now. You willing to do some work? What kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. 
We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Why do you need my help to build beds? Look, we got a lot on our plate, and we've been on the run for weeks. We need food, water, shelter, you name it. Well, you asked how you could help. I told you. Did you mean it or not? I'd be glad to help. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything.
nothing I hate more than raider scumbags. If you run into any, put a few down for me. In the day, I had quite the shot.
Things are tough now, but they'll get better. Hey there. Yeah? Stay sharp. Don't let your guard down. Take care of your gun. It'll take care of you. Please, just... Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. Oh. I guess drinking from the river isn't good enough for you. Well, we've been getting by. But the surface water isn't safe to drink regularly. I'm not looking for anything fancy. A well or two would do the trick just fine. Sturgis. I feel better already, knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help, but our food supplies are running low. If we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. I'll start planting right away. Good deal. Hey, Sturgis. Well, this place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go with this. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. I'm on it. Ah, thanks. It'll make everyone feel more secure here. Hey, Sturgis. Thanks for doing that. We'll all sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road, but yeah. I think this is it. Oh. Feels good. I was glad to help. Well, I appreciate it. Of course you know you're welcome anytime. My door's always open to you. Windows too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. I hope you find your son. <laughs> 